Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have my April Ipsy Glam Bag Plus unbagging. I do these every month, but I've been getting my bags like really late the past couple months. So these have been going up a lot later than I would typically like. Um, anywho, yeah, we're gonna go ahead and jump into my unbagging. So if you'd like to see what I got in this month's bag, then just keep watching. <music> First thing I'm going to pull out of here is this eyeshadow palette and it's from Bella in Argent I think I have no idea how you say that I've never heard of this brand before this is my first time ever hearing of them it's a nice just like it's kind of hard to open um, but I have this on today I just threw this shade in the crease and then I put this purple shade all over the lid. And then I put this other shimmery shade on the inner portion. And then I took a small detailed brush and did like a bit of a wing with this deep brown. So that is what I have on today. Just super easy. I'm going to swatch these for you guys. This is the one that's on my inner corner. It could also be a really pretty highlight. This is what is in my crease. The pigments on these are really nice. And then there's this orangey one. So the mattes are really nice too. And then let me show you these three shimmers. So this is really nice. It's really pretty. Um, I forgot to take the sticker off. I love doing this. Oh, and that eye stays on there. Interesting. Huh, that's cool. So I do like this. I mean, I do have colors like that already. The only thing I don't like about it is the packaging. It's one of those that's gonna, going to get really dirty. You can see all my fingerprints all over it. I don't know the price of this because Ipsy doesn't come with like a sheet that tells you the price of everything. So I'm going to pop all that on the screen if you guys are wondering. So the next thing I have in here is this face palette. Typically I don't keep face palettes, but I thought I'd keep one just because the last several face palettes I've gotten, I put in giveaways. So I'm going to keep this one. It's from K-Boss. It's their highlighter. I'm not sure what that is. I've never heard of this brand either. It comes with three shades. This is hard to open too. Ugh. My goodness. It's going to take me a minute. Okay. So it comes with three shades. So I used this bronzy one as like a bronzer and this pinky one I tried to use as a blush. It didn't really turn out so great. And this one I used as a highlighter. I will swatch these as well. They feel so nice. So that's them really pretty. I think it turned out nice. I do really like this. So I'm glad I decided to keep that. And then there's two skincare things in here. This is from the Nuco. It's called the Pill and All-in-One Serum. Um, I just use this kind of like as a primer. And I feel like it left my skin nice and glowy. And then the other skincare item is a lifting eye serum from Hey Honey. So again, like these products, I'm obviously going to have to test out more and gather like a more of an opinion. This is just my first time using them. But this serum felt very, very runny. And I just like squeezed out a little bit and I feel like a ton came out. So for future references, I'm just going to have to apply less than I think I need to because it is very runny. So here is the eye serum and then the face serum. I love getting skincare. This month was a nice mix of makeup and skincare. And then the last item in here is from Ofra. It's this lip gloss, lip gloss, lip gloss and pink panther. I love Ofra lip glosses. They're some of my favorites. And this color is so cute. It's like this nudie pink color. I have it on paired with a ColourPop lippy stick. I don't know where I put it, but it's in the shade O Snap, I believe. But this is just it's just so pretty and it's not sticky at all. Very lightweight. I like absolutely love this. I want to buy more Ofra glosses. The only thing is though, I don't feel like people are really wearing 
at least I know I'm not, not wearing any lip products hardly ever because if I go out and if I'm wearing makeup, I'm wearing a mask and I don't really like wearing lip products unless it's like a liquid lipstick that I know won't budge, but I wouldn't wear a lip gloss if I'm wearing a mask. But that is all I have in this month's bag. This is like the first time in a while that I'm ending up keeping every single product, which is really nice for me because I tend to always put stuff in my giveaway, which I still have like a big giveaway box. If you don't know, I'm doing a giveaway every single month on my channel the whole year of 2021. So just be on the lookout for my May one. My April one is already over. Thank you all for who participated in that one. But yeah, that is all I have for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.